Hello, and welcome to my animal cartoon drawing class. Today, we're going to be doing the letter T. And T says, it's time to go outside. These turtles are so funny. They just sit on these logs. And then if anybody comes by, they just jump off. Oh, and look at the little baby turtles. Aren't they just so cute? So are you ready to start the letter T? Let's go inside and get started. All right, let's begin by drawing the letter T in the middle of your page in a rather large T going down here like this. Now I would like you to make it even bigger on the top. Bring it about out to here, about one finger's length and bring it out to here. All right, now we got a pretty wide T. Now I see this point right here. We're gonna do a curved line from here all the way down to here. And we're gonna do the same thing over here, all the way up here. Curved line all the way up to there. Now I would like you to do some more curved lines. So we're going to start about right here, about a finger's length up right in the middle. We're going to curve it down to here, all the way around, like a little half circle. Now let's go up another finger length, draw a line, and let's do another curved line. Go down, kind of matching this one, and we're going to kind of go down and matching that one. Okay, another finger point distance and let's do it again curving down the same way same on this side curving down very good now let's do another one right here and i'm going to curve down and curve down and let's do one more Right here, going to curve down and going to go across and curve down. Okay, now I'd like you to draw some lines right next to those. So do what I do. Starting right here, going to draw a line to go right along there, just close to it. Another one close to this line, not very far away. And now we're going to do another one following this line. Remember, it's close to it. See how it goes? And now we're going to do another one right here. And now we'll do one right here. And right here. Now we're going to do some little bumpy curves from here to here. From here to here to here to here all the way around. A little tiny bump. A little curve all the way around. Let's keep going, keep going, keep going. A little more over here, like that. And let's do a little bit on the bottom too. Curvy line, curvy line, curvy line, curvy line, curvy line, curvy line, curvy line. Now we're gonna add to this line, a little line right next to it right next to it, right next to it, and again, and again. Now we're gonna do some more curvy lines. So let's go about right in the middle here. Gonna go curve, 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 curve. And now right next to that, curve, 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 curve. Now let's do the same thing on the other side. I'm gonna do it about right here. We're gonna do a curve, 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 curve. And now a line next to that. Curve, 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 curve. What an interesting animal, oh my goodness. Okay, now we're gonna do a sideways V. So over here, 
I'm gonna start about right here. I don't know, let's do it right here at the bottom, right at the bottom here. Curve it up like that. And then we're gonna bring it in like a V, just like that. Huh. Now, from about right here, I want you to draw a, lot, a little dot right here and a little dot right here. Let's go in about two spaces. All right, we're gonna go out like this. Zigzag up, zigzag down, zigzag up. And then we're gonna bring it to match that line. Okay, oh my goodness. I think I might be tricking you on this one. All right, the same thing. But the middle of this bump, do about right here, just about that space, however it works in your picture. And let's go out and then zigzag down, up, down, up, and then bring it to that dot. We are almost done. Do you have any idea yet? All right, let's do from the middle of this here, and then this dot right here, two dots. We're gonna make like a light bulb, a light bulb. Watch me. We're gonna go out and around and in. Kind of looks like a light bulb, right? All right, let's do a circle right here. And let's do another circle and a dot inside. Do you think you have an idea? Let's turn it around. I tricked you. And what do we have? <gasps> we have a turtle. Turtle stirs his tea. All right, let's do one more thing. He needs a mouth. So let's do a little curvy line in and another curvy line. And let's make him smiling. And let's do a line right here, right across the eye like that. Very good. Let me introduce you to Teresa the turtle. Oh, Teresa loves to be out in the sun and bask on the logs, just like we saw our turtles doing. So much fun, but Little Teresa better be careful because there is no lifeguard on duty. So better hold on with those legs. So today's verse with the letter T is one of my all time favorites. I mean, I have this memorized and sometimes in the middle of the night when I'm worried or I'm fearful, I say this verse and I feel so much better so I can't wait to share it with you. It's found in Proverbs 3, five and six, and it's kind of long, but I still want to share it with you. So this is the first part. The T is trust in the Lord with all your heart and do not lean on your own understanding. That part means trust him when you don't understand what's going on. Sometimes we don't get it. We don't know why things are happening the way they are, but we can trust the Lord. So we don't lean on our own understanding. Then it says, in all your ways, acknowledge him and he will direct your path. So that means if I don't understand what's going on, I can trust him and I can acknowledge him in all my ways. That's kind of like, I see him, he is with me everywhere. I recognize that he's with me and then he will direct my path. I don't need to worry because he will guide me and lead me in the right steps. So it's a long one, but let's read it again because it's a really good one. Trust in the Lord with all your heart and do not lean on your own understanding, but in all your ways acknowledge him and he will direct your path. All right. Thank you for joining me today. And next time we'll be doing the letter U and we'll see you next time.